Yo, what's up? How you guys doing? Hope everybody's doing well. It's already Feb so fast. Time always passes so quickly when a brand new year comes up. It's not even surprising. But you know what's surprising? is the matter of fact that up till now, we haven't had any like weird moments or very like funny people doing some crap. Huh? We haven't had them yet though. No. There's no potential top 10 idiots of 2021 yet. <laughs> that is surprising. <laughs> But soon to come, soon to come. <laughs> right, so it's been some time since I spoke about these scams or review online courses ever since certain things happen. <laughs> and I know some of y'all will genuinely be like, but Rishi, won't this cause you any more issues? I appreciate it guys, but no worries. I now know how to actually do it. And that is why in this video, we're going to cover a few things. Firstly, the 50k forex scam. And then I'm going to go inside of Telegram to show y'all the current investment crap. But there's a lot to come. Let's, let's get into the video. Before we even go into this, let me just say I have a lot of sympathy for this person. Not only is he 49 years old, but losing his life savings at this period of time is... <laughs> It's just really rough lah. But everything gotta start somewhere and for this case, it all began at stage 1. Curiosity. Lin, not his real name, 49, came to befriend a lady called Jasmine in 2020. It started off innocuously. We chatted for at least 2 weeks before she even started asking questions like if I had a side hustle and whether I'll be keen to invest. You know, to be fair to this Jasmine character, at least she used the word like, yo, do you have a side hustle? She wasn't like, oh, hey, you wanna you wanna retire early or you wanna become a multi, 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 multi-millionaire. <laughs> you know, things that we usually see, things, or rather things that we see lah, things that we see across the internet. But remember, this was just for two weeks. It obviously got to go to the next step, right? And that's where stage two comes in, the small talkings. Despite never meeting in real life and never having heard her voice, Lin thought Jasmine was a good friend. <sighs> they would chit chat about their day and talk about everything under the sun. So they were in contact for two weeks and they basically became text buddies. Ooh, Jasmine's good. Jasmine's playing a very different long-term game. Huh? Instead of just stuffing it to him and telling him things like, you'll just put in $100 and then you'll get back $1,000. She's like, no, let's talk about your day, your work, what you did today. Bro, it's like, ah, uh, it's like back to, back to what, what's the, what's the relationship stage they call it? Ah, uh, um, honeymoon stage. Yeah, it's like it's like they are on the honeymoon phase, ah, huh? and she's really putting it in, no. But the way I see it, you've already opened up a straight freeway, ah, huh, for her to go into the next stage, already. And that is what I call time to muscle. Her broker ZJ helped Lin set up his account. Z was also the one who facilitated all of Lin's monetary transfers for the investment. The broker's identity was never verified through a video call. Neither did Lin ever hear Z's voice. I just don't know how to describe Lin at this point of time. Like, like, is he so innocent? Is he oblivious? Like, this is the second person without verifying literally anything. He just put the whole them like he put his whole heart whole trust on them just like that it's, it's just sad lah it's just getting more and more sad this story Lin is like so pure that it's making me so frustrated lah Ayoy. on Jan 1st Lin transferred US 20k to open a standard membership account standard members he was told would receive trading strategies which if followed would guarantee them a win for Bro, this is just sus. I'm not a trading expert and this is not any sort of financial advice, right? But if anyone, and I mean anyone, comes and tell me that, bro, put this in, I guarantee you, 100%, I will straight look at him and I will say, bullshit. Big time bullshit. Also, he transferred US 20k. It's written as what? Uh, Singapore 26k. Bro, that's like half of his life savings, right? How, how can you just simply do that? Like even, bro, even if my mother asked me to put in that amount of money, I'm finding out everything. Like who, what, where. I will find out down to the dot before I even consider putting in, you know, like... <sighs> that's why lah. That's why I feel bad for him. He's like so pure and innocent kind of kind of person but uh you know what unfortunately it gets worse stage four mothership just said it best crash and burn the broker dropped lin a message informing him that a trade was going on and asked if he was confident to invest that day this time the broker encouraged him to buy more since you're confident however within a few minutes of trading everything changed lin not only lost the money he'd invested with mt5 
but was told that his account had a deficit of US $40,000. Ayo, what happened to the trading strategies and the guaranteed windfall and the, and everything? What, what happened to everything? <laughs> like I said, like I said, bullshit! I, I can't emphasize it more. This, this has been so fucked up from the start uh, that, ah, uh, oh, I swear to God, I swear to God. Hello, the risk control center reminds you that your account is currently a negative number and you need to repay the debt. You need to deal with the account balance. If you do not reply, the risk control center will transfer the matter to the legal department for processing. Yo, again, the thing is I don't trade and I'm not a professional in all this, but it just screams fake. So it's not a question of how much time you can have. You need to deal with it as soon as, oh my God, I will pay you 30,000 within the first five days. Ah, uh, Lin, ah. Uh. Oh my god, look what he said, but you give me a bit of time, I won't run away. Uh, <laughs> oh, it hurts so bad looking at this. Oh man, I feel for you, man. I, I... <sighs> This whole thing was just a very unfortunate incident, man. But there's a couple things that we can learn from this as well, right? If you want to get involved with all this, especially when so much of money is involved, please, for goodness sake, go and do your research. Like, go and know who the hell you're dealing with. Are they like trustable? Know what you're actually in there for. You know, there's... Do your research, lah. Just do your research. And, and, if somebody's guaranteeing you that you can make so much of stuff, <laughs> in my opinion, I call bullshit, but you make your decisions and please make a wise one. <laughs> Let's move on. Let's move on to the telegram. I share something more interesting, okay? <laughs> What you guys are looking on your screen right now is actually my own telegram. I joined this group to show you guys how they actually work. And there are tons of this Bitcoin cash, blah, blah, blah. So look at this. This group right here, Bitcoin Trading and Investment Company, has 67,000 members. That is crazy, you know. And look at their investment program. Huh? You put in $400, you can take out $8,000. And you put in $2,000, you can take out $22,000. That's the returns la, that they are promising. La. That's the investment program. They take a lot of steps to make people believe that this is real. Updated people like us, we will look at this, we will be like, hey, come on. La. But people will buy into this, especially when they have strategies in play. Example this, they put in a lot of text messages. Look at this again. Okay? I was so scared and at the same time, Time, discouraged by my friend who fell victim of a scam in one of the investment companies that make him lose his job due to exhausting cash from the bank. They put up messages like this because these are these are usually the same thing. People get scammed on another ground, then they think that oh this this place this has so many subscribers, this has so many people. It has to be real. And with messages like this, like it's acting as if it's coming from clients, people will definitely buy into it. They have another step, like it's a level two uh, strategy lah. They put up payouts, you know, you look at all this, they put up all this like, like uh, motivational words and success and patience and start investing. Look at this plan. Invest one Bitcoin and earn five Bitcoin. That's so dumb. That's... in. Like you don't even have to work for the rest of your life, right? Let, let's let's be real, lah. So this is the level two make believe. You see down here they read payouts loading. Down here they have so many so-called receipts that they have paid out to people as if these people invested with them and they have paid them out. And these are the receipts. And you know what? When you click on this, when you actually click on this, you will see like it's on blockchain.com, lah. And you can see status is confirmed. Uh, wait, sorry. Status is confirmed and then output is 7 bitcoins and the value is 243k, right? And then you see here, it's confirmed, it's 9 bitcoins and it's 328k. These are like so-called receipts that people will see and they're like, oh my god, people are actually getting paid. And you know what the mindset will be? If somebody is getting 328k, why won't I get 4k, right? So you get, you get how it's working now and with the text message and with this and bro, if all this is not enough, they go level three. What is the best way to make believe of somebody that's human interaction? Let's take a look at some of these so-called uh, clients, la, testimonies and, and all that. They have like 300 over videos, right? Look at all these so-called human interaction, uh, client testimonials and whatever. Let's, let's hear a few of them. Let's hear a few of them, okay? Today is May 14, 2020. And I received $1,250 from Bitcoin Trading Community. I thank you, sir, for your help. This would be a big help for my family. I'm Noor from Indonesia. I have received my profit. And thanks so much, Mr. Richard Cook, to help me for trading. And I love this channel. I won't reinvest again. Thank you, Mr. Richard Cook. Help me 
out with three hundred dollars and making it into six thousand in the time of my need. I really appreciate it. Thanks. So basically to summarize everything, how it works is your cash, you need to translate it into Bitcoin and then you transfer it to them. And then they will tell you, okay, in two weeks, this $300 will become 5000 and they will pay you in uh, Bitcoin. They will pass it to you in your Bitcoin wallet. La. After like two weeks, you will find where your money is, right? They will tell you, oh, sorry, the money is stuck here and stuck there. So you need to pay an additional uh, four $500. Then you'll be like, ah, oh, never mind, I'm getting 5000 right? I'll just put in another 500 la. To get it, the 5000 I'll just put in another 500 la. It's okay. They will add and add this problem, that problem, that problem, and it will go on and on and on. That, my friends, is the Telegram investment scam. Please, Please, please be very careful with all of this crap lah. That was actually a reason why I wanted to make this video based on this topic because uh, recently I think most of us will know about GameStop and uh, Dogecoin and all this. Elon Musk pushing Dogecoin to the moon. So much going on now with stocks and investing and this and that during this time. So just wanted to say be very careful with your money. You won't know. Don't just join the hype without any knowledge and then end up losing millions and millions. By the way, this whole video is no financial advice, nothing. <laughs> I'm just giving my own opinions on all this, um, especially when people are giving guarantees all around saying that you can make millions and millions by doing ABC. I'm like, yep, that's bullshit. That's to me. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to make this video for that. I hope you guys enjoyed, got something out of it. Let your friends know, let your family know about um, all this Telegram kind of thing because when it comes to easy money, there is always no such thing as easy money. Lah. You, you gotta work for it. You just gotta work for it. And I hope and none of y'all find another Jasmine or find another Mary or Tom or Dick or Harry or... <laughs> hey, it's sort of rhyme, right? <laughs> but yeah, yeah, have a good week ahead. I'll catch you guys next week. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like this video. And hey, yo, come follow me on Instagram as well. And I'll catch y'all next week. Peace. <laughs> Tom, Dick, Harry. <laughs> Peace, guys.